Welcome everyone to the part two of our lesson today. Now we are going to move on and do some writing exercise. Okay, so open your student book on page 52 and we are going to do some exercise. Okay, so go to page 52. And what I need you to do now, I need you to read the paragraph. You can see letter B, you have how I cope with the stress. You have a small text there. So I need you to read that. Okay. I'm going to give you some time to read the text. And then we are going to do some activities together. Okay. Just go ahead and read the text. Okay, uh, I hope you had a you had no difficulty in reading. Uh, I think um, I hope you also have noticed that 
in this text, you have two paragraphs. When I feel stressed on a warm day, that's the first paragraph and the second paragraph, when I feel stressed on a cold winter day, okay? Why is that important? That's important because now we're gonna move to page 53 and we are gonna do exercise 2C, okay? So let's go to the next page. Now let's do exercise 2C. Notice here that you have to answer a few questions about the first paragraph and then about the second paragraph, okay? I'm gonna give you some time to answer these questions and then we are gonna do correction together, okay? Go ahead and answer these questions. Okay, so what you have to do is just go to letter C and answer these questions according to the reading that you did. 
you have two paragraphs so let's go ahead and do the correction together okay so let us see topic sentence for the first paragraph when i feel stressed on when i feel stressed on a warm summer day what's the topic sentence i'd like to curl up with my cat listen to classical music and read an interesting book that's the topic sentence right the the first right in the beginning right okay Oh, so wait, wait, wait. I, that's the second one. So for the first paragraph is the summer day, okay? When I feel stressed on a warm summer day, I like to work in the community garden in my neighborhood. I like to work in the community garden in my neighborhood. That's the first paragraph. That's the topic sentence, okay? And ways of reducing stress what's the cause the cause is sun on my back and what's the effect lessens muscle tension the cause and the effect so what's the other thing the cause Ways of reducing stress. For example, uh, the birds, right? The birds, he says, the birds. What's the effect? Relaxes me or relax me, right? And the other cause is talking with other volunteers the effect makes me forget my troubles okay so the second paragraph is the same thing what you had to do for example when i feel stressed on a cold winter day i like to curl up with my cat listen to classical music and read an interesting book it's okay so that's the topic sentence now ways of reducing stress okay uh, what's the cause stroke my cat's fur stroke my cat's fur that's the cause and the effect is helps my body relax mm -hmm. I feel less tense. That's the effect. Another cause for uh, listening to music with eyes closed shuts out noises. That's the cause. Cause is listen to music with eyes closed. And the effect is shuts out noises and reduces anxiety. Mm -hmm. And the last cause, read stories about people with difficult events in their lives. And that's the cause. And the effect is forget stress in own life. Okay. So that was a simple reading with um, a comprehension exercise. Um, if you have any questions, please let me know. Okay. Well, let's move on now and continue here. Let's just do one more exercise. 
why don't we just go to our workbook open your workbook let's see here And it's in, open on page 50. You have exercise one and exercise two. What I need you to do is to do, to answer these questions. Okay, I'm gonna give you some time. And again, it's about action and result or cause and effect. Okay, that's the same thing, okay? Uh, I'm gonna give you some time to answer these questions and then we're gonna come back to do the correction together okay do exercises one and two page 50 and after we'll do the correction together okay Okay, let's now do the correction. Workbook, page 50, exercises one and two. Uh, exercise number one, you have to just identify if it's an action or a result or like we did in the past exercise, if it's cause or effect. So number one, I take a long hot bath. What is this? Is it an action or a result? It's an action. And what's the result? My body relaxes. That's a result. Okay. So let's go to number two, letter A. I can't sleep. What is I can't sleep? I can't sleep is the result. I drink a lot of coffee. Letter B is an action. Okay. So I can't sleep. Result. I drink a lot of coffee. Action. Let's go to number three. I work for 10 hours. That's an action. And letter B, I feel very tired. That's the result. So I work for 10 hours is action. 
I feel very tired, result, okay? Number four, I feel less tense, action, or result. I feel less tense is result. And I listen to quiet music is action, okay? So I feel less tense is result. I listen to quiet music is action. Number five, I watch a funny movie. I watch a funny movie is action. And I forget about my problems is result. So I watch a funny movie action. I forget about my problems result. Number six, my muscles loosen. That's a result. I stretch my arms and legs. That's action. Okay. So my muscles loosen is result. I stretch my arms and legs. That's action. Okay. Um, I'm going to send you the correction of exercise number two later. Okay. For the sake of time. But if you have any questions, just let me know. Okay. Send me your comments your questions through email, um, text message, or through our WhatsApp group, okay? But for now, let's take a break before our next section of our class, okay? So let's take a short break. Bye-bye.